Hello friends, my name is Dan Gurjik and this is Fit You, your home for fitness education. The basic shit we should have learned in gym class. What is fitness? How well you sleep, how well you move, and how well you breathe. So those are the three pillars of fitness that makes up the foundation of fitness. Our posture. Bing, 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 bing. So let's dive into what are the three elements of fitness training. There are three elements. And I'm going to break that down into what are these elements in relation to our muscles and how they need to be trained. Because there are different muscle fibers and muscle types and muscle actions. So all these things need to be trained accumulatively throughout your week and throughout your training progression. The first element of fitness training is a big fancy word called concentric. Ugh. Concentric, let's boil it down to push. So a pushing movement. You're walking, running, biking, pushing. So your cardio, that's a push movement. You're constantly pushing. You're running, push, 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 push. You're biking, push, 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 push. You're rowing, push, 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 push. The elliptical is a pushing. You're pushing with your toes. These are all pushing activities. When we walk in daily life, that's kind of a cardiovascular concentric movement in which we're using our breath and pushing with our legs. So your muscle fiber is only responsible for that push, 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 push. Also, you're holding good posture and you're breathing while you're focusing on the push. That's cardio training. When running and we think, I'm running, I'm doing really good things for my body. You are, but your posture, <laughs> no bueno. So we gotta work on the posture. Lift yourself up when you're running. Be able to take a breath in through your nose and out through your mouth and feel what that feels like through your diaphragm. So we look at cardio training as just like, I'm on the treadmill and I'm listening to my music and I'm watching television and I'm running, running, running. But if you're watching television like this and you're hunched over and you've been working at your desk all day and you get up and you go run, if you haven't checked your posture, your posture is where you were frozen at your computer hours ago. So now if I'm running with this posture, I can't breathe well. So when we do our cardio, we're focusing on how well we're breathing with good posture while focusing on the concentric, the push movement of your leg and how your hips and your core work in that cardio training. That sounds very technical, all of this concentric stuff, but it's just you on a treadmill. So when you're on the treadmill or walking through life, focus on how good your posture is, focus on how good your breathing is, and focus on how your hips and your core are working together through that push movement. That's cardio training. It doesn't have to be complicated. It's just knowing that you're focusing on posture, breath, and concentric pushing movement.